One of the most significant events that occurred in Xi Shaq's Dessalines life would be when he declared the island of Haiti to be an independent country. Because of Dessalines past, Haiti became the first black independent republic in the world. After a signed declaration of independence, Dessalines declared himself as governor general for life, and soon later he declared himself emperor. Dessalines was born into slavery. Therefore, he witnessed and experienced lots of torture and received many deep scars. Because of these horrors, he detested Caucasians, and soon as he gained power, he ordered the killing of Haiti's Caucasian population, resulting in the 1804 Haiti Massacre. From this genocide, he soon became notorious for being ruthless and unforgiving, and stated, Haiti must be wiped of every French taint. Dessalines attempted to maintain Haiti's sugar and coffee production without the use of slavery. However, Haiti soon became economically devastated. Also, because Haiti was a newly formed independent country and did not use slave labour, other countries did not like it and were unwilling to trade. Before their independence, Haiti produced 40% of the world's sugar intake and 60% of the world's coffee intake. In order to maintain this, Dessalines ordered that all dark-skinned people were to either serve in the army and protect their island from invasions, or to work in the plantations and fields, which a historian named Michael Ralph Truller described the regimen as agrarian militarism. He enforced this law so strongly that the population of Haiti felt like they were being enslaved again. Soon, everybody of Haiti was planning a conspiracy to overthrow him. Eventually, Dessalines was killed by his own soldiers with numerous shots from the open fire on October 17, 1806. Jean Jacques Dessalines became an icon of Haitian nationalism at the beginning of the 20th century. In, order, in honor of Dessalines, the national anthem of Haiti is La Dessalinienne.